One of the things that we do as part of our degrees is we work in partnership with those in our local community. Uh, Sporting Calcer is a club based in Willenall and we work in partnership with placements, opportunities, volunteering and student succession into work. One thing that we'd like to really showcase with our work with partners like Calsa is inclusivity and how diverse we work with partners that are in and around our footprint of the university. If you're studying with WLV and uh, studying a sports uh, course, there's a range of uh, placement providers that we have partnerships with, which include Sporting Calsa, um, Walsall FC, uh, Wolverhampton, and uh, we've also got collaborations with uh, Albion Foundation, Villa Foundation and we're also always looking for new opportunities for our students. It's important for our students to, to get out into the local community to sort of showcase you know, what they're learning and also to develop their skills. So building those connections and, and chance to network with uh, the different organisations and providers is really key to their employability uh, post-university. We're, we're delighted to, to have a partnership with um, the university and we're, we're really looking forward to, to embedding some of the, the workforce to support our structures and, and programmes going forward. It gives them a sense of opportunity um, and also belief. We're very much about trying to provide an opportunity for the community so even our men's and women's playing at the highest level possible who knows where they could be in the next few years with the support of the university. It's very much about the community and that is the core model of what we're trying to create around here. They bring energy, drive towards this football club whether it's through areas such as um, performance analysis, whether it's through coaching whether it's linked to our community stuff or it's our team based stuff, whether it's our link to our community programs. There's so much opportunities out here. The jobs are here, the opportunities are here, so we can bring real life experience. So I think this partnership becomes a match made in heaven, I would say. I wasn't really sure what I wanted to go into, so I knew I wanted to do coaching football. Then once I was on that course, that's when I fell into analysis through one of the modules. So my placement, I ended up working at Birmingham City Ladies for a year or so, just doing analysis there, which helped me learn a lot in a professional football setting and then it's helped me bring that to here. Well, I work with the under sevens, so I've coached them every Wednesday for about an hour each week. At the moment, I'm just assembling a team and also as well preparing them for next year because we're hoping to compete in the, in the, in the league uh, for under sevens. What I've learned like, during my time like, working with my team with the under sevens is uh, using different like, coaching styles and different techniques and how to coach different kids whether they've got like, a disability or additional needs and, and also as well how to deliver session plans and planning your sessions ahead. Yeah, it's a really great club. Like, it's really, really diverse. So for me, coaching was a big, massive thing for me. But since my doing the degree, I've kind of thinking, going, oh, I want to do the science side, or oh, I want to do the analysis side. So it really helps you expand your knowledge. It helps you develop as a coach and just get experience in different settings because I've never done community football before. It's really helped my confidence and my knowledge because before I had no idea what I was going into. Getting experience is a big massive priority. You can have the courses and the quals, but it doesn't matter if you got them. You need that first-hand experience. I know what my future goal is. And if I didn't do this experience, I know I couldn't get there. Um, I want to be a first team football coach manager and to be in this sort of community because I didn't think I could get here. Where I am and to be able to be a female and a football coach in this community, it's just amazing.